So the Arkle is next then. This is a two mile novice chase. Grade one, of course. And a field of ten for this one. At the top, we've got Chris for David Hooley, who took the opener. Day to day, Martin Leedham, Phil and Tricker, David Robertson, Il Duomo, Darren Thompson, The Supreme, Joshua Sutherland, Astonishing, Paul Rhodes, Common C, Leon Van Rensburg, Phoenix, Flames, Paul Rhodes, Scottsdale, Lady Vinnie Gerard, and the roadmap for Joshua Sutherland. So, field of ten then. Called in and ready to go. And away they go. And down on this near side, Astonishing is the first one to get out of the lead. It's a short run to the first, and then all safely over it okay with Paul Rose at the front and the back. Astonishing and Phoenix Flames. Astonishing then two lengths clear as they race to the second. Which they've all got over safely, although Come and See made a bit of an error at the back. And Astonishing has settled down in front by two lengths with Phil and Tricker closest to us in the turquoise and pink hoops. Well, that's been overtaken now by Scottsdale Lady, who's moved through into second place. But it's Astonishing in front from Scottsdale Lady second as they get to the third. And all safely over that one. And on the inside rail, Crisp is in third place now. Oh, that leader went right through the top of that one. Gave it an almighty wallop that got away with it as they come past the furlong pole. And a swing left-handed and Astonishing will lead by about two to three lengths from Scottsdale Lady in the green in second for Vinnie Gerard as they get to the fifth. And a mistake there by Vinnie Gerard. Scottsdale Lady's allowed Crisp to move through into second. So David Hooley got off to a winning start in the opening race. In second place at the moment with Crisp. In third place is the Supreme for Joshua Sutherland in the black and red hoops. Just behind that one, Phoenix Flames has made a forward move from the back. Second of the Paul Rhodes horses. And Il Duomo with the maroon and white sleeves for Darren Thompson. With on that one's outside, Phil and Tricker in the turquoise and pink. Just behind that one is a Scottsdale Lady who dropped back a place or two. And they get over the water. Come and see as now recovering from those early mistakes. And the road map is towards the rear with day to day the back marker as they get over number eight and they're all safely over the eighth with astonishing set of the pace uh, leading by about five over fence number nine they go and all safely over that one with astonishing racing uphill clear in front from crispin second and the supreme is third then he'll duomo fourth and comes phoenix flames come and seize after that one and the back four just headed by day to day as they take this ditch all safely over the ditch. One or two a little bit slow towards the rear day today, finding the pace a bit hot, but at least he's still on his feet. And astonishing is two to three clear of Crisp in second. The Supreme making a forward move around the outside, and also Stable Mate, the road map now starting to creep a little closer to try and reel in the lead in three. But Astonishing's led all the way so far and doesn't appear to be stopping. The jockey's keeping it up to its work. There's four furlongs to go, and this is the third last. And over that one, Astonishing landed in the lead from Crispin second and the Supreme third. The road map looks to be going ominously well in fourth. There's a big gap then to Il Duomo and come and see day to day. He's trying to make a run through. Then comes Phoenix Flames and Scottsdale Lady with Phil and Tricker having dropped out of the back, but it's Astonishing who's just about hanging on in the lead then from Crispin second, then the Joshua Sutherland pair third and fourth as they swing towards home, they've still got two to take and it's Astonishing on the inside, Crisp on the outside, they land together, but a better jump by the road map who now comes alongside and it's three in a line racing down towards the final fence, Crisp landed in the lead, the road map's over its second, Astonishing is now beaten, the Supreme's trying to run on, they're inside the final third and it's Crisp in front from the road map and the Supreme, then comes Astonishing, finishing well, Scottsdale Lady, but Crisp is in front and this could be another one for David Hooley as they race up towards the line, Crisp is going to take the argle, Crisp wins it, the road map second and the Supreme and Scottsdale Lady, and he'll blow on Phil and Trick and come and see disappointed. Uh, day to day got round. But David Hooley, two races, two wins. What a start to the festival for him. As Crisp takes the Arkle. We have the roadmap for Joshua Sutherland second, the Supreme for Joshua Sutherland again third. Scottsdale Lady for Vinnie Gerrard's on a big race in fourth, and astonishing for Paul Rhodes, led most of the way, and hold on for fifth.